how have you been working on that in practice and preparing for that? Uh, we've tried to replicate their blitzes as much as we can. Uh, we've looked at a lot of film and watched and um, tried to find out what they're going to do. Um, so we try to have the scout team tune into what they're going to do so we can uh, prepare like that. Do you feel like the offensive line has come as far as it should to be able to protect you going up against them? I have complete faith in them. They're, they're going to protect me well and uh, couldn't trust them more. Talking with David Yost, he's never actually had like a true freshman quarterback mm -hmm. starting for him and he said he's been really impressed with how each week you've just been kind of leaps and bounds improving. What has caused you to be able to make such great strides? I think just great guys around me. Um, got a great system. Great older guys teaching me the ways. Uh, Taylor Riley, Dakota, Jeff Lockie, those guys are great. And they're helping me a lot. So are the coaches, and uh, it's a good system to be in. What is the relationship like with Dakota being the starter, kind of on the sidelines now? What's what's your relationship like with him? Dakota and I were uh, good friends before when I was a backup, and so <coughs> uh, we were good friends. We we spent a lot of time together, and so he's he's been really great since um, since then. He's been really supportive, and he's helped me with as much as he can. Is there anything uh, working on your game right now that you, you wish that you could improve on? Is there anything specific you're working on in practice? Um, I think trying to be more vocal, uh, vocal with the line, communicating better with the receivers. Um, just really quickly, Halford talked about a void in leadership the other week. Since he made that comment, have you noticed anyone stepping up to fill that role? Uh, yeah, there have definitely been a lot of guys stepping up and uh, taking charge of the team. Could you name anyone? Uh, Cameron Hunt, he's been very vocal. Um, Linebackers Troy Dye and uh, Brennan, they're, they're doing great out there.